Kins, thank you so much again for bringing us back to Dubai Watch Week. Obviously, every Dubai Watch Week is special, but is it more is it more emotional this year after after what we've been through last yes. year? Yes, ever since we announced that we're we're coming back physically, that's where we felt the emotions coming out from everyone who who knew Dubai Watch Week and visited Dubai Watch Week. The moment we announced Dubai Watch Week is going to be a physical event, people started uh, you know posting throwbacks and what of, of their experiences, and it was really really emotional. And we felt like okay, now we have a big response. Responsibility. We need to make sure that with the with the pandemic, with the restrictions, with everything, that we're still going to deliver and we're going to give them the same experience and and you know the same thing they remembered from 2019. Are you happy with the 2021 edition? Yes, we're so happy. We're already exceeding the number of visitors per day that we, we had a target, you know, and we're exceeding the target. So it means that even the local community, you know, we're waiting for Dubai Watch Week. Getting out and coming out. Yes. Last question, because we're all having such a great time. Couldn't you do this again next year? <laughs> no, Suzanne, don't ask me to do it next year. Let me tell you why. There are various reasons. One of, one of them is we would like to give the brands more time to prepare to come to Dubai Watch Week with more you know exclusive launches you know and the watch industry needs time so there's time for that and then there's time for my team to sit you know and and work on on, on the 2023 event but also work on the horology forum because remember horology forum 2022 is still going to take place that's true yes so well, we're going to work on that and then right. we'll see you in 2023 don't worry absolutely thank you so much <laughs> thank, you. thank you so much